everyone, Luke here, welcome back to the channel. So over the past couple of months, we've been doing a lot of stuff with acrylics. So I decided to make a hot knife that'll be able to cut through acrylic, no problem. Right, so let's talk about what you're gonna need. So to do this is actually stunningly easy, and all you're gonna need is two things. You're gonna need a soldering iron, which I've got right here, and this one's just a spare one, and you're gonna need some sort of cutting blade. So you can either use a Stanley blade, but you're gonna have to chop it down just a little bit. Or you can use an X-Acto knife blade, which I've got right here. And as you can see, it's a little bit smaller and it will fit straight in. So it's up to you what you decide to use. So the idea for this DIY hot knife is to take this little end attachment out. And as you can see right here, I'm thinking about chopping it right here so it's nice and flat. And then what I'm going to do is take a saw and just cut a slit all the way down to where these screws are. So that means I should be able to insert my blade into the slit, stick it in the soldering iron and tighten it up. That way it should clamp the knife into place and keep it all nice and sturdy. So when you turn it on, it's going to heat up that blade and you should just be able to cut through plastics like acrylic. So let's get on with it. So I finished fabricating the soldering iron piece and as you can see the slit goes down quite far and that's just because I want to make sure that this blade is going to get clamped really nicely when it's in the soldering iron. So let's take another look at that. So this is what it looks like when the blade is in place and all I've done is I squeezed it in the vise to make sure that it's nice and stable so the blade doesn't move when I'm trying to reattach it to the soldering iron. Right, so you've got to make sure that this is the right way because you want it to go like this, so the slit isn't facing towards the screw holes. Right, now we know that, we could just stick it in, line it up properly, stick that back down and start screwing it in. And there we go, the blade is in there and that is completely solid. Right, so let's turn it on and see if it will be able to cut through some plastic. Okay, so now our hot knife is heated up, I've set up a few examples right here. Here's some plastic from just any sort of packaging that you can buy from a store. Let's give it a try. We'll go right here. Look at that, that is really going through that no problem at all. Very nice. So now I've got a bit of 1.5 millimeter acrylic right here, and we're just gonna test this to see if it can cut. And right here, here's a line that I'm gonna go down. And there we go, it cut through 1.5 millimeter acrylic quite easily actually. It took a little bit longer than the uh, plastic packaging, but it still did a nice job. Wasn't that an awesome result? And I'm willing to bet that it can go through thicker stuff. Anyway guys, so this brings me to the end of the video. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to put them in the comments and I'll try my best to answer them all. Anyway guys, I hope you have a great day and I'll see you later.